Hello everyone, welcome back to Rip City Rundown, and today we will be previewing and predicting the 4-13 matchup out of the East region between the Tennessee Volunteers and the Louisiana Ragin Cajuns. Tennessee, let's start with them. They come into the tournament 23-10, and and they were one of America's most physically imposing teams. They were first in defensive efficiency. They're the best defense in the country. This Tennessee team is, again... The defense is just elite. They went fourth in the SEC at 11 and 7, 23 and 10. They did have a season-ending injury to their top scorer, who was Zakai Ziegler. Their offense is a little bit weaker. However, the defense is just so darn good. They l- allow opponents to the lowest field goal percentage. Uh, offensively, they're not the most consistent team. They are an SEC team who fights hard on the defensive end, they hold opponents to 58 points per game. They're 5-3 and three against the top 25, but they're second in BPI, and they themselves they score 72 points per game. This team is legit. This team is poised to make a deep run, and again, that defense is just such an X-factor. Let's jump to the 13-seeded Louisiana Lafayette Ragin' Cajuns, or should I just say Louisiana? This team is led by Jordan Brown, the former McDonald's All-American. He averages almost 20 points per game and 8 rebounds. This team was very good in the Sun Belt. They finished second in the Sun Belt in the regular season at 13-5, and and they went on to win the conference tournament after beating South Alabama. This team averages 78 points per game, good for 47th in the country. Um, and they give up a hair under 70, so a good positive differential there. Again, the former All-American Jordan Brown is the leading scorer here. However, it will be difficult for Louisiana, I think, in this matchup just because of that ferocious defense that Tennessee boasts. The Raging Cajuns sneak into the top 100 in BPI at 99th. Uh, some notable results for Louisiana. They played Texas and lost by 28. They played Drake, who's also in the tournament, and lost by 12. Louisiana is an elite rebounding team, but they aren't the most consistent on offense, similar to Tennessee. I think you're going to see a low-scoring game in this one. This team is apparently an accurate three-point shooting team, which is important when you want to pull off an upset. Again, though, I just don't know how much space they're going to be afforded, and Jordan Brown is going to have his work cut out for him against this Tennessee defense. I know it's the thing that I keep talking about, but it is the X factor. It's a tough call. I am going to take Tennessee quite handily, honestly. I don't think Louisiana has the offense or the uh, second and third options behind Jordan Brown to combat this Tennessee defense. Give me Tennessee to win by about 10.